welcome to Z Elizabeth Beauty. Um, this is the look I've been cre I've been creating. I have created for you. I'll come back from the future. Um, stay tuned, and I hope you like it. I'm just gonna start with some foundation. I have two foundations. I have Revlon Photo Ready in 003 and 17. This is the one that you get um from Boots. It's their sort of brand, not number seven, 17, and it's um just a foundation these were really cheap they're not expensive at all this is this one was about um 12 pounds and this one was about i want to say four or five um this is my color this one is really stupidly dark i would never wear this on its own i don't know why i bought it to be fair um but yeah mixed together um they're gonna be good for summer especially as this one has an spf of 20 this one has an spf of 15 so we're not gonna get wrinkles Right, just wanted to show you how dark that foundation is. Look, that blob in the middle. Why did I ever buy that? Anyway, um, I've already put a little bit of moisturiser on. Um, well, love on my face. <laughs> then I'm just gonna um, start working this in. I do like this foundation. Mm -hmm. Now, um, things I do have sort of acne prone skin, um, I feel more confident wearing a foundation in the summer. Um, some of you may find something like a BB cream or a tinted moisturiser a bit better. Um, but this is like how I do it because that's how I feel better about it. Um, speaking of that, I then use a concealer. <clears throat> Again, this is optional. This is the Collection 2000 Lasting Perfection Concealer. I just pop a little bit under my eyes. Um, I have darkness around my mouth here, and then any blemishes that are really visible. And I just use the same foundation brush and sort of buff out the edges. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is sort of bronze up my face. Um, this is a natural collection one. You can see it's nearly all gone. Um, in Golden Glow. I don't know if you can see that. Um, just on a um, number 7 brush. Just swirl it around in them and take a tiny bit off just on my hand here because we don't want to go bright orange. Um, I put this on my cheekbones slightly across my nose. Places where the sun would naturally hit you. If we're going to put it in our contour line, um, you're just sort of going to get more of a contoured face than anything. Um, I think we want to be bronzed. Go right across here, blending out the edges, and then up into the temples and across the forehead slowly. Just like so. Um, so we're sort of looking a bit more bronze and golden now. Um, then I'm going to do my eyebrows. Now, in summer, I always do my eyebrows. I don't really know why. I just like eyebrows because I sort of wear minimalistic eye <laughs> makeup. Um, this is my sleek makeup palette. Um, it's the oh so special one. I'm mixing at the moment the black <laughs> and this sort of brownie colour here on a Bobbi Brown fine liner brush. I don't think it's meant for brows but I'm going to use it anyway. Um, I dyed my hair um, really dark so I'm sort of trying to have to match my brows to it. Just filling in the gaps. I'm not going OTT with them actually. Like so, so they look a bit more polished than they sort of did before, but I'm keeping them quite natural, that's why I'm using sort of a um, powder for them instead of a pencil. Um, now on my eyes, I don't really like to wear full makeup in summer, um, that's just me, because maybe I'm running around being a loony. Um, so for this one, I'm just going to sort of keep it really simple, but sort of still with that glowing theme. Um, I have a... Max Factor Smoky Eye Effect sort of double-ended 
like cream pencil. Um, one end is this dark brown, just looks like that, and the other end is this sort of creamy colour. I'm just going to be using this all over my lid, so I'm just going to be roughly pushing it all over my lid. You can go all the way up to the brow if you fancy, I'm just going to keep it here for today, and then definitely right in this tear duct area. On the other side. And I like to just take it off. Um, then just taking your ring finger, slightly blend out the edges. Just like so, so it's sort of um, slightly shiny, but still really quite natural. Um, eyeliner and things, I don't wear eyeliner in the summer, I don't really ever wear eyeliner that much. Um, but for my lashes, I don't touch that much either, I'm just going to, let me just try my curl one. Um, <clears throat> I just like to take my curlers, these are from Superdrug, they're just one ninety nine. they work, which means they're fine for me and just slightly curl the top lashes. Ah. This scares me so much. Oh. Um, and then I like to take my Rimmel London Extra Wow Lash Mascara. I really like this. Again, really cheap. Really inexpensive, I should say. Then I just do a little tiny coat of it on my top lashes. Mainly catching these out ones. Um, just like that. Um, normally I leave like to leave it like this but sometimes just for sort of a bit of addedness I like to just add sort of a lip colour. This is a body shop um lip butter in strawberry and it's just pink. It's not really like a tinted lip balm. It's well it's it's a lip balm and it is slightly tinted but And there we have it, that's sort of the um, finished glowing look. I um, hope it's okay. Um, this is just what I wear in the summer, um, just because it's easy and quick. Um, so I hope you enjoyed it and it was lovely to see you. Bye bye.